In this video, I'll be going over part 2 of making a game of Pong. If you haven't already, go ahead and watch part 1 where I've explained what you'll need to make Pong and a screen resolution for Love2D. But today, I'll be talking about a library called Push and the function love.keypressed key. Anyways, hope you guys enjoy the video. So once we open up our text editor, we're going to want to create a new file called main.lua. So in this first line here, we're going to um, we're gonna be using a library called push. So what push will do is that it will take our um, 1280 by 720 window and turn it into a virtual resolution of 432 by 243. And this function over here, function love.load, basically just starts the game. And this uh, love.graphics.cell default filter, this is just a text f text filter. And here we're um, initializing our virtual resolution. And over here we're um, setting full screen to false. Uh, we're setting um, resizable to false and we're setting vsync to true. And here we ended this function. Down over here, this is where we're going to start to use our new function. So this function is called uh, love.keypressed key. So basically this function does all the keyboard handling. So basically if a key is pressed, then something will happen. So in this case, we have if key equals to escape, then this will trigger the function. So if we press the key escape, then it will trigger this whole function here. And what it will trigger is love.event.quit. So basically that will just close the game. And here we are ending this function. And over here we have function love.draw. And this will basically just draw things on our screen. And over here we have push apply start. So this will just begin rendering um, at our virtual resolution. And love.graphics.printf hello pong. So over here we have love.graphics.printf. And basically here we're just um, printing a hello pong and we're using our virtual height and virtual width for our text placement. And for this last line here, we have push apply end. So this will just um, start rendering at our virtual resolution. And then we end that function. So that's basically the library push. And um, that's the love.key pressed key. So now if we um, run this thing, we can see our hello pong here. And if I press um, escape on my keyboard, then the thing will just close. And I cannot resize it or anything. So yeah, that's basically it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed this video, please drop a like and subscribe for future videos. Anyway, see you guys in part three.